fear. So what is fear? Well, fear actually stands for F, false, E, evidence, A, appearing, or real. False evidence appearing real. Okay, and it's actually your mind's way of sending feelings into your body connected to a perceived experience. It's actually the greatest misuse of your imagination. And it's your imagination that causes you to have these feelings. Your perception of an upcoming experience, no matter what that is. Okay? And it's this experience that is created from past experiences. Maybe past failures. I don't know. So when we work with fear, we can work with the past failures that cause you to feel these fears. And then we can work with the future expected fear. So we're working on two levels so that your experience in the future is going to be excellent. Because as you know, many times you've expected something to be a certain way that's caused you to feel fearful. And that has never happened. The actual experience is not as fearful as the anticipation of the experience. And so, in some ways, it causes this uh, paradoxical loop to keep going in some way. That you expect fear, you have some fear when you get there, and then it creates this cycle, this loop, in some way. And so, this is what we're going to be working on. We're going to be working on your past experiences of fear, and your expected experience of fear.